Broke Down in Waco. Find out what the story is right after this. Welcome back to P.O. Rider TV. That's right, we are broke down in Waco. Well, actually it's Robinson, Texas, right next to the pilot. Exit 328 on 35. We're at the MHC Kenworth dealer here. Remember last month I was here when my, the differential rear end was leaking. I brought it here and they fixed it. So I was in the area, I was coming down 35, I got in a big old traffic back up, up there about walks of Hatchie, where all that construction is. Uh, sat there about an hour just sitting there in a back up. And I stopped there at the rest area after all that cleared up, right there at Hillsboro, the new one, the new rest area. And the engine fan just didn't sound right. So I noticed when I was Driving, I heard some kind of weird noise. I don't know what it was, some rattling or something. I said, well, I'm gonna stop down here at the pilot at 328, check all this out. So it was my engine fan. I don't know if it's a clutch, air leak, or whatever. So I immediately came over here to the MAC Kenworth dealer. I didn't want to take, well, it's, it's working. I might, it's, it'll be all right till I get some. So I didn't want that to happen get stuck out in the middle of the road somewhere, had to get a tow bill, so I called dispatch, told them what was going on. I said, I probably, they're not probably gonna see me until tomorrow at the shop. So I'm here in the hotel room across from, uh, right next door to the uh, shop. But man, that engine fan, that has given me problems for the last two years, ever since that certain mega carrier I won't mention here. Took out my front end and all that was replaced. I don't know if it's if that has anything to do with it or it's just getting old. It's got a lot of miles on it. But this is about the three times right off the top of my head I can think I've had that replaced. Counting this time. Hopefully this time it's something different. Maybe it's a belt tensioner or air leak or something. The guy seems to think he went out and checked it out, the guy that writes up everything. He's a it's it it's uh well, what do you say? It's not engaging or something. So I don't know. I don't know. We'll find out tomorrow but you No, know, we're really looking forward to catch this here. Everything was looking good. Every year it's always something different. Two years ago I was in a hospital there in Garland, Texas with a bout of diverticulitis. I think last year I was having some kind of maintenance issues. I think that was where I had my uh, DPF filter went out. Man, I tell you, it's always something. It's always something. So I'm trying to think about what I want to do, what are my options. If they get this thing fixed tomorrow right away, I still might make the truck show. If I get out early enough, if they haven't got somebody to come get that load yet, I might be able to go ahead and make it. I think last time I was here, I left here at noon and I was still down there by six or something like that. That's not bad. Five or six, I can't remember, but we still made it on time. Maybe I won't have to give up the load. I don't know. We'll see. If they haven't already sent somebody in to get it, I don't know. So that's what's going on. We're going to sit here and chill out in this hotel room and find out tomorrow morning what's going on. Uh, hopefully I can give you an update then. Tomorrow sometime. I don't know if they get it done and get it out of there early. Might not have time to do an update so I'll have to be rolling. While you're waiting around, be sure to check out all my other videos. If you're not subscribed, subscribe, hit that bell icon, that way you'll be notified every time a video is uploaded. So everybody have a good day, better than I'm having. Take care of your engine fan, it's a very important part of your truck. And don't forget to stay safe.